Early years is tough, it's challenging, but ultimately it's the most rewarding job you can do. Working with young children, making a difference with really young children at the start of their lives. At the moment, uh, there's only a, a small percentage of uh, male staff in the early learning sector. Um, and that's a bit of an issue. We've got loads of um, families that don't have a male role model uh, at the head of them or with them, and um, that can have a negative impact on children. Uh, and there's lots of men out there that don't know their own, own potential and what they could offer to the sector. By four, People have absorbed, you know, these youngsters have absorbed all of these gender cues that are happening in life. And it's just not helpful. It limits boys' options and it limits girls' options. Um, so, absolutely committed to diversifying the workforce. I think it's hugely important. I've had a long-standing professional interest in how great early years experiences can foster integrity, community and empowerment in people for life. Parents, men included, fathers included, still have this perception of safety, leaving their children in the care of a man. And that is more challenging for childminders. So being a man, working on your own in your own home, the perception of that is a real challenge that we need to try and overcome. Um, I think there are plenty of opportunities for men. This sector is undergoing a major expansion in Scotland. Uh, there are 11,000 additional places, um, uh, you know, more and more workers coming in. Um, so plenty, plenty of opportunities. There are many routes available. They can go through the college route, through the university route, or can undertake work-based learning. Younger men, older men just simply don't think of it. Or well, you know, it happens in a haphazard way. They know somebody and who just says, oh, you know, have you thought about coming in and just getting a little taste of experience in this setting because I think well, you might be good at this. And, and then it happens like that. I think it's an opportunity to challenge gender stereotype in our society and to show the children men can do all sorts of things. Not necessarily being a carer is just the women's job, so that we challenge gender stereotypes from generation to generation by having more men working as carers and educators in the early years. We're really pleased to be able to share the, the reasons that men have come through and encourage more men to consider early years as a career in the future.